Hi Beehive, I'm Christina McDonald, the USA Today best-selling author of The Night Olivia Fell, Behind Every Lie, and my newest, which just came out this week, Do No Harm. And I would love to talk about your book recommendations. What are some of your favorite books from the last maybe year or so? Give me some recommendations. Usually I read in the thriller suspense genre, but just tell me any books that you really love, something that really affected you, something that you just highly recommend to all of your friends. Pop, it, pop those um, recommendations in the comments and make sure and tag your authors and let them know how much you love their book. Just for fun, I'm gonna give you my top three. So, the most recent book that I read is by Robin Harding. It's a, um, it's basically an uh, advanced reader copy of her newest book that's coming up, I believe this summer, and it is phenomenal. I'm just gonna read you the synopsis, which is, the story follows the Adler family, who seems perfect in every way, until one day their house is egged, then fruit, then tomatoes are thrown, then a smoke bomb. Then their car's tires are slashed. The attacks escalate until the fire is set outside their home while they're asleep. Helpless to stop the attacks, the Adlers grow increasingly terrified. But each of the Adlers is keeping a secret. Which of them is responsible for the harassment? And I read this book and why I loved it is it is just so escapist, which just, you know, sometimes we need a book that's escapist. We just don't want to think about what's going on. We just want to escape into the pages of a book. So that is why I loved this one. It's unsettling. It's darkly sublime. It's compulsively readable. I could not put it down from the moment I picked it up, couldn't put it down and I finished it in two sittings. So I highly recommend that. Again, The Perfect Family by Robin Harding. And the reason why I printed it out is because most of my books I actually read on Kindle. I don't have a lot of physical copies. Um, my next recommendation is by Hank Felipe Ryan, The First to Lie, which she released last year, 2020. And the synopsis for this is what happens when an undercover reporter gets in too deep and when a practiced liar has to face off with her own truth, how does she choose her true reality? who will be the first to lie. The reason I love this book is it's really thought provoking. It's very twisty, of course, and, and you're following the mystery, but it's really, it's also about deceit and justice and revenge. And it's centered around the devastation that is wrought by a large pharmaceutical company and the family that owns it. So I found it really smart, really timely, and just really tightly plotted. So I really enjoyed thinking about the plot and and the characters and everything that they did. So again, I really highly recommend The First to Lie. And my last recommendation, I do have a physical copy for, is called Maybe You Should Talk to Someone, and it's by an author called Lori Gottlieb, and it's so good. I read this over Christmas, and it's quite a big book, so it took me a while, but it's so good. It's charming, and it's funny, and it's thought-provoking. It's about a therapist, Lori, who, after a very traumatic personal event, has to see a therapist herself. Meanwhile, while she's getting treated by a therapist, she's also seeing her customers, her clients, and she is helping them explore and mine the depths of their feelings. And I just found it so heartwarming. So if you want a book that just makes you feel warmed on the inside, this is your book. Again, it's called Maybe You Should Talk to Someone by Lori Gottlieb. So those are my top three recommendations. Tell me what yours are. Pop your book recommendations in the comments and tag your authors. Thank you, bye-bye.